Here I got a 1993 Kawasaki Ninja EX500. I got a all the fairings right there, the gas tank, um, parts everywhere, man. But I, um, I got a good deal on it. Um, the guy said that it starts, but it's been, man, when I got it, it was hecka dirty. It, and I spent hours cleaning it, wiping it. Um, he said it hadn't started, he hadn't started in a couple years, like three years or something like that. But, um. So I went and got a battery for it. Hundred dollars, man. Damn. Got a battery for it. And it wouldn't start. Cranked the key, nothing happened. So I was like, damn. So now I had to figure out. So right here. Hey, it goes um the starter relay switch. Which I took that off and tested it, and I have no, I didn't get no reading on it on the multimeter, so uh, this probably was bad. But what I'm gonna do right now to show you, see what happens is I'm gonna hook up the battery to the starter and see what happens. If nothing happens, then maybe this is bad, and maybe that's good. Either, either or. So let's see what happens. Okay, I got a battery. So first what I'm gonna do is I gotta hook up the negative and the positive. Oh, hold on. So the negative is gonna go back here. You see right there? In the back, that's the negative. And then the positive is gonna go on the one in the front. Right here. Okay. And then what you do is you hook up positive to the positive in the battery. See what, what does it say right there? Positive. So this is the positive side. Okay. So I'm gonna hook up the negative. See what happens. It's either gonna start. I mean, uh, wanna start or no? We'll we'll see what happens. Is it ninja? Kawasaki Ninja EX500. Alright, here it goes. Nice. Okay. So, it's not the starter. It's this. The relay bad so I have to go get one all right